Welcome back to more Let's Go Eevee, everybody. What the hell happened with this freaking Onyx here? This Onyx just spawned right now. I was just actually about to record the next video. I'm like, what the hell? Record it now, record it now. Oh my god, this is crazy. Well, you know what that means. Let's see if this actually works. Um, yeah, so anyway. <laughs> um, welcome, everyone. This was kind of a weird intro because I just saw the Onyx and I, you know, just made a rush for it, of course. Was that small or big? I didn't actually see the circle. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it escaped again. It escaped again. That was actually a low or a small circle, so maybe that'll work. I'm trying to avoid using freaking berries right now until it gets tougher and tougher, you know. But anyway, got the onyx, another new catch. Pretty good stuff, I must say. Nidoran male level 14, um, okay. And then Nidoran female level 13, sounds good. Okay, so, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. So I got a couple comments um, in the last couple episodes, and one of the big things is that Eevee actually cannot evolve in this game. Um, they did do some like offset kind of thing, I guess if that, that makes sense. Wait, oh, I already came, what am I doing on the wrong side? Uh, to like make up for it, they actually raise Eevee's stats pretty significantly, apparently. Um, so that's also why Eevee's like demolishing everything with freaking head, but that was cheap. That was a cheap ass spawn right there. It's huge! That's what she said. Alright, um, let's see here. We're gonna throw it right there. Ooh, very small circle. Heck, yeah. I'm doing it because the side is huge, so like, I'm gonna get some experience from this. It was, it was a first catch, and it's huge, so yep. Only 48, that wasn't actually too much. Bellsprout did level up though. Okay. That's some good stuff right there. That's some really good stuff. I like that. Okay, we're just gonna, yep, we're gonna go back in there. And we're gonna keep on going. There's another Zubat over there. Okay. Who did I put in the front? Is it Eevee right now? I think it's Eevee. Then there, oh, look at this. Just an item over here. All right. That works. What's up, you? This Team Rock is actually facing the wrong way. Usually they'd be facing to the bottom right there. I know this game. I know this game really well. Not this game, but Gen 1, I should say. I know Gen 1 really well. Team Rocket Grunt. You have only one Pokemon. It's a Zubat. Okay, I think I had Eevee in the front. Yeah, so I'm, Eevee, I'm just going to go ahead and have you headbutt. And you can actually get this, get this one-hit kill. I'm down to six headbutts now, though. Hmm. Should be fine, though. Shouldn't be a problem, really. I think it's okay. Alright, there we go. Alright, next up is- Oh my- I hate it when they spawn in your face like that. That's such bullshit, man. Okay, run away. I don't know if I'm doing this right. I'm running away from these Pokemon. Um, there's another Paris there. Then there's a fossil guy over here. What's up? Hey, stop. I found these fossils. They're both mine. Okay. <laughs> That's really random. Super Nerd Miguel. Voltorb. Okay. So, you might actually outspeed me. You are a Voltorb. Let's see. No, you didn't. Okay. Let's see how much damage at this. Okay, this, this Eevee is on freaking steroids over here. Seriously. That 70 base power stabbed. It's crazy. Ooh, now we got a Magnemite, though. That's actually a part steel. So I'm gonna have to double kick you. There we go. Yeah, Magnemite is actually electric steel. Which, um, before Gen. What Gen was it where they removed the fact that steel resists ghosts and dark? It's either Gen 5 or Gen 6. Before that, though. Magnet, uh, Magneton or Magnezone, whatever, um, was actually super crazy OP, um, with def defense-wise at least. Dome? Dome or Helix? I'm gonna take Dome. I'll take Dome. That's actually, uh, that's Kabuto, which evolves into Kabutops. Okay. Stop right there. Hands off, that fossil belongs to us. 
How did you even get here ahead of us? Because y'all were just looking at stuff on the right side, that's why. We're Team Rocket. I'm Jesse. And I'm James. And the two of us are going to take that fossil back. Alright, if you say so. So, uh, you all have multiple Pokemon? Is it three Pokemon? Let's see. Oh, it's a double battle. Okay. Coughing and Eggin. So I got my Eevee and Nidoran male. There we go. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and do a headbutt. Well, the problem is, I don't, I don't know if I'm actually gonna kill any of these shits. Okay, I'm gonna do that to you. Okay, coughing is easily gonna survive this move, but I'm, I'm trying, I'm doing this so I can guarantee a kill. If I headbutt the coughing, I actually don't know. Okay. Oh my god, I actually forgot about this shit. Oh my god, I totally forgot about. Wow. Previous battles and shit, you know. Okay, we're gonna do a quick attack on the Agans. And I'm hoping you do a horn attack, sure. On this coughing. Alright, take care of that Agans, there we go. Level 16 for Eevee. Getting stronger. Oh heck yeah. Leader I woke up, yes, horn attack. Yeah, no, Coughing has a very high defense stat. Um, so this headbutt is not going to kill this Coughing. There's no way. Uh, you saw how much it did to the Agans. It almost killed. Um, but yeah. Yeah, see? And he's still not going to go down, even with another Horn attack now. Yeah, the, the key is to use special attacks on Coughing. The counterpart, I think, is actually Grimer, because Grimer has a high special... Um, defense stat, but a lower defense. So for grammar, you want to use physical attacks. Eggins is uh, just different, I guess. I don't know what, what Eggins is actually good at in terms of stats. Probably nothing, but it's just a balanced, mediocre Pokemon. I'm pretty sure. Yep, a twerp beat you. How do you feel about that? All right. Another Zubat over there, we're just going to go through. Route 4, Mount Moon, Cerulean City. So let's see, what's down here? Anything, anything over here? There is an item. That is a Paralyze Heal, I will take that, okay. Now we're just gonna run on through. Actually, anything else down there? Well, I'll grab the item over here first, since, you know, obviously there's an item over here. Five Pokeballs. I will take that. That's about all I see here. Well, actually, there's more over here. Have these routes been expanded a little bit? I think they have been expanded on. Like, they weren't like this before, were they? Unless I'm losing my mind over here. There's a repel. Okay. Another item up there that I probably cannot get. Yeah, that's going to be for when I come back later, right? I'm pretty sure. What's down here, though? I want to make sure I don't miss anything. Oh, wait. I already jumped through. Whoops. Uh, it's impossible to go back now. Okay, I didn't miss anything. No, I didn't. Okay. Why is that Rattatat all the way over there? Do you see that? This Rattatat. This Rattatat, man. Three Great Balls. Okay, now run before it gets you. Okay. Cerulean City. Okay, so here in Cerulean City... I mean... There, honestly, there isn't that much to do within the city itself right now. Like, there's a bike place here. Yeah, but I'm not going to be able to get one until I reach Vermilion City and I get the bike voucher. So there's no point in going there. Um, let's go... I guess I can go back to the other... Wait, what? What's happening? 
What? The fountain? I'll throw 500. What's happening? Evie looks happy. What? Just for throwing money in there? Okay. Why, because I'm selfless? He was like, oh, my owner is so selfless. Alright, well. That's cool. We are going to keep going to the next buildings. But yeah, so there's a Pokemon. I don't really need to go in there, though. I'm going to avoid that. Failed again. Tackle. Tackle attack. There's uh, the Pokemon Center. And then here's the gym. What's up? Wow, look at this. I don't, really, I don't think I'm going to do the gym right now, though. I'm pretty sure I'm not. Yo, champ in the making. Mr. Gym Leader of this really in City Gym is a powerful trainer. You'll need at least... You'll need a Pokemon of at least level 15 if you want to challenge your gym. Which I do. I have one of them. Yep. Okay, but I'm not going to do it right now. I mean, I guess I can take on the, the rookie trainers here. Whatever you want to call them, right? But I'm going to put someone else in the front because... I'm actually going to put out Bells probably because, you know, you are a grass type. So this is this is your shit here, you know? Can I go up there? No. Or are you just going to see me from here? Yes, you are. Alright, so we got three trainers here. I'll get some experience from this, which is going to be pretty nice, I guess. Beauty Lily. Goldeen. Goldeen, Goldeen. Goldeen, Goldeen. <laughs> okay, so... Um, your move is going to be uh, Vine Whip. That's Stab times two. Oh my god, no. No. Shit. Shit. Don't you dare, don't you dare. Oh, thank you. You're a lifesaver, Bellsprout. That didn't even do half. Oh my god, that thing is a level 16. I just... Level 16 Goldeen. Whoa. It's getting up there. What the hell? What the hell? Oh god. Oh my god, what did I just get myself into here? Quick attack. Okay, that's fine. That was crazy. That Goldeen. Do I dare keep going? I don't think I dare, right? You know what? I do dare. I do dare to keep going. Alright. Number two. Beauty Violet. Shelter. Okay. Uh, the problem is that Shelter has a really high defense stat. And buy with its physical. Man, Bellspray, you need to learn something new, seriously. At least he outspeed. Oh boy. Water gun. How much does that do? I can take a hit, but that's. Oh, what if you have an ice move? Oh god. If you have an ice move, I'm dead. Nope. I can survive this as long as it doesn't crit. Okay. Uh, please don't have ice shard. <laughs> oh my god. You did. You're such a dick. <laughs> also, why didn't you just do Ice Shard for the first time? That would have been a super effective move. <laughs> Are you stupid? <laughs> I predicted that. I totally predicted that. That was ridiculous. Wow. I somehow knew in the back of my head, like, wait a minute, this is totally gonna happen, isn't it? God damn, man. Oh my god. Is this really... Is this like a sign? Because, like, I'm really trying to think, like... Here's the thing, there are at least new moves, and oh my god, are you gonna kill me? How much did that do? Okay, I, what the heck. So there are new moves, so that means that potentially there is there is a lot of potential for good grass moves to be learned from Bellsprout. Because if it was only Gen 1 moves, Bellsprout would be terrible, because what, there's Razor Leaf? And then what's best after that? There's like nothing better after that. Helping Hand? I'm gonna say no. Um... Yeah, because there's like, what, there's... Petal Dance is a strong move in Gen 1, but I think that's exclusive to Vileplume, that family. Um, and there's Solar Beam, but that's Solar Beam, that's not exactly the same thing. 
Um, I'm gonna have to go back and heal up. But yeah, I mean, also because, you know, it's a freaking bell sprout. Um, hasn't evolved yet, unfortunately. So I don't know. Oh no. The other problem is Vine Whip is just a base 40 power move. That's not exactly anything intimidating, you know? I just need some good moves to be learned from these Pokemon here. Because, I mean, so far Eevee has been the one that's been just pummeling everything through. The others, not so much, but I know that Nidoran male is at least going to um, evolve soon. I think it's level 16, I'm pretty sure. So he, he's close. He's close to becoming a Nidorino, which is a buff in stats. That's really good. Uh, let's just keep going. I am going to just proceed upwards up here because this is actually, um, how you... Oh, it's a rival battle, that's right. What? Okay, that was weird. Pokemon Trainer Tim. Pidgey, okay, that's not bad. Pidgey is pretty simple to deal with. Also, I see you have three and not four. Hmm. Normally would have four Pokemon at this stage in the game in Gen 1. Usually what, Pidgey? I think you have a Rattata too. Um, then you would have a... I think you have an Abra, and then your starter. I think that would be your team. Yeah, this horn attack isn't cutting it, but that's because you have to... Oh no, you used a potion? Are you serious? Fine, fine, you do that potion. Hopefully I can still two-shot you from here. Ooh, that's going to cut it close. That's going to be a little close. Okay, do we have a speed tie? I think we do. Are we using quick attack? I wasn't paying attention, to be honest. Level 14, okay. A Pikachu. This shouldn't be a problem. Well, actually, I mean, the other shot could... Oh, god damn it. Don't you dare be a dick. I hate... We can double team spam. You gotta be kidding me. Here we go. Horn attack. Yes. That actually didn't do as much as I thought. I thought it would do at least half damage, but it didn't. Okay, that did seven damage. Luckily, horn attack is not missing. So that's good. Oh god. You have to land this Nidoran nail. You have to land it. Here we go. Please land it. Yes! I'm getting lucky. Hell yeah. I got lucky. Thank you. Thank you, game. Spiro level 12, okay. Oddish. Alright, well. <laughs> Same thing. Well, actually, no, Peck would do more, sorry. I should, I should be doing Peck, my bad. It would barely be a difference. Horn attack is 65 base power. Peck is 35 times 2 non stat, it would be 70. So it is 5 power stronger, to be fair, but it is something, so I'm gonna do Peck. Yeah, see, it's, you can barely tell the difference. Uh, I'm gonna win this battle, it's gonna be annoying, um, because it's taking forever here with this freaking absorb shit. Okay, there we go, and an acid, I also resist that, that's fine. And here's Peck, okay, that, that's a win right there. Rather, um, rather tough right there couple of those at least a bit a few okay why were you so like what the heck was wrong with you dude deep breath okay let me try that again what okay what the hell it was a Pokemon that talked also I see an item over there I'm gonna grab that Oh shit, wait a minute. Oh, I think there's an exit from one of these here. Um, no, it's fine. That's the badge guy, that's right. Yeah, so over here, we can, we can get to an item. There also used to be a secret item here. Let me see if, it, if it's actually a thing. I'm just spamming the A button everywhere. I don't think so. I'm pretty sure they removed a bunch of these secret items and stuff, you know? Yeah, I don't 
I'm not getting anything, so... Okay. We're just gonna go back. So, I should probably go back and heal again. Really taking a beating here, you know, from these Pokemon. I think it's because I'm not catching enough Pokemon. Like, seriously. Also, people were telling me that, like... So, like, you can send Pokemon to Professor Oak, but you should only be sending, like, duplicates, apparently. I'm not exactly sure why that is, but, um... Okay. Let's see. So, if I go to... Ba no, 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 not party. Uh, bag. Pokemon box. So, like, for example, if I send... I have that many... Oh, my God. Send to Professor. So that's one, two, three. I'll send the lower ones, I guess. There's a Bulbasaur. I have two Geodudes here. Um, send that one. Anything else is a duplicate? Oh, Bellsprout, of course. Duh. And I guess that Oh Weedle. Send. Earn some candy. Mighty candy, tough candy, quick candy. Okay. So I just keep sending you more and more and more as we go? Hmm. Wait, I don't know. I mean, I was getting comments to, like, leave these here. I'm not totally sure why, but I'll, I'll believe that. Also, what, what does this do? Um, I got some stuff here. Increase attack by one. Okay. Do I want to give all that to Eevee? I don't think so. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure, to be honest, but we'll see. I, I'll just hold on to this stuff for now, that's fine. Okay, so I'm at, what, 22 minutes in this video? I still got some time, I'm good. I'm just gonna go through. Alright, here is, what is it called, Nugget Bridge? We got five battles to do here, and we get a Nugget at the very end, plus an offer to join Team Rocket. Venonat. Okay, well, Peck is actually my best move here because you are Bug, I think what, Bug Poison? So, this does do more damage than the freaking horn attack. It's a level 9, though, so the levels are back to being a little bit lower, as you can see. So, that's... I mean, I'll take it. It'll make the battle slightly easier to just pummel through. And this guy needs to evolve already. This need around mail. Damn, it's taking forever, though. Such little experience, you know? Three Pokeballs. Okay, cool. Battle number two! Now it's serious! Oh, I bet. I bet it's serious. Last Alley. Psyduck. Okay. We are going to do... Horn Attack. My best move. Bam! Okay, I'm getting hit by a water gun, that's fine, that's not gonna do too much. Just another horn attack here, getting through these trainers. Level 15 for Bellsprout, please learn a move. Damn it, I need you to learn some new moves, Bellsprout, so you can actually be better. Like, seriously. But at least you're evolving, or not evolving, you're leveling up a bit, so you can actually be a little bit better fitted for the gym that's coming up. I don't even know if Bellsprout's going to be able to do shit to Misty. You're a grass type, but... Oh my god, I mean, I'm going to face a... Face. <laughs> face. A star you and a star me. Oh god, this battle's going to take forever. It's going to take like four hits to kill you. Not more like three, but... I think it'll be three. Yeah. Sand attack. Oh no, now it can take a long time though because I just got sand attacked. My accuracy went down so I can miss... Shit. Okay, hold on. Damn it! 
I missed. You avoided the attack. No. Stop being a troll. I swear to god, if you do it again, I'm just gonna switch out. You can do it one more time. Okay, you connected, yes. Scratch. Okay, it should, should be fine. I mean, even if I miss one more time, it's okay. It actually worked. I connected... Well... A lot of the time here. Peter Ryan Mill's almost there. Almost there. To, neater, to being a Nidorino. Number four. Alright. Last Rally. Or really. Rally, really? You have a Meowth? Well, that's good news for me because I got my double kick. This can actually one shot you. Yeah, this should one shot you. Oh, god damn it. You're your fake outs. Okay. Fake out is a move that um, has priority over any other move in the game. Or most others, I should say. 100% um, chance to flinch the opponent, but it only works the first move that your Pokemon is out. Oh my god. That actually may not have killed if I didn't crit that first one. Wait, no, it would have, because aren't crits just 50% more damage? And I don't know if this game uses the old mechanic of critical hits doing twice the damage, or the new mechanic where you do 50%. I don't know. Wait. Did I level up with Nidor and Mail? Hold on, hold on. I don't know if I actually did. Let's see if I did. No, I didn't. Okay. Oh god. Am I gonna die here? I can take a hit, right? Horn attack. Ember. One HP. Oh, that, that was. Oh no. Really? You. This is the kind of... <laughs> Don't even say anything. Fuck this shit. What is the chance of that move critical hitting me and also burning me? It's a 6.25% chance to crit. And it's what, a 10... Either 10 or 30. I think it's a 10% chance to burn. 6.25% chance and then when you take 10 percent Reduce that by 10% of that? It's le basically, it's less than a 1% chance, let's just say. Less than a 1% chance that that could happen, and it actually happened. Both things combined, I mean. Unbelievable. That kind of shit pisses me off when that happens. I'm like, what the heck? Seriously? It's like the game knew, it's like, oh, he's about to level up to a Nidorino. We, we gotta take care of him right now. We have to. We have to do it. And it totally just did. Now I have to run all the way back. To heal, or else Nidoran Mill's gonna not get any more of that experience. Unbelievable. Unbelievable but true. I mean, so far, this game has been a lot less rigged than almost any other Pokemon game, because yeah, there are obviously a lot of Pokemon games when you're facing AI, there's rigged systems in there of percentage chances and shit, but like confusion and paralysis and, you know, and all this crap, but. So far, it's been pretty good. Just that right there. Seriously? It was less than 1% chance. And that happened? Are you kidding me? I'm pretty sure it is. I was trying to think of the maths, you know, but yeah, I mean, it should be. 10% chance of burning. And then 6.25% chance. So that means that that's less than 10% of... Yeah, because if crits were 10%, then that would be a 1% chance in total. Because it's a 10% chance for the burn, and then you take one, and then you take 10% of 10%, which is 1%. So it would be a 1% chance if both the crit and the burn were a 10% chance each. But because crits are 6.25% chance, it's actually lower than 1%. Yes, okay, so that makes sense. That makes sense. This guy's always like, "Come on, join," but yeah, your character just says nope apparently without you having any control or saying it. This guy has two Pokemon. Wait, are you like the first non-boss trainer to like have more than one freaking Pokemon? Well, actually, no, but the thing is you're a mini boss, so you don't count. I'm talking about just a regular freaking trainer. 
I haven't faced a single regular trainer with more than one Pokemon, right? I'm not talking about gym leaders or rival battles or this guy right here who's the head of Nugget Bridge or um, or Jesse and James, you know? But yeah, I don't know. I don't think I've seen one yet. Okay, so that's going to get Nidoran Mill to level 16. Well, it should have happened in the last battle before that rig bullshit, but okay. Coughing? Are you serious? You know how long it's going to take me to kill this guy? Should I do Leer? Okay, well that's fine, because that's a poison type attack, and... I'm a poison type, so I can't get poison. I'm going to do a Leer. Because this will guarantee me to kill you in two more horn attacks, I'm pretty sure. Looking at the HP right now, I don't think two more would be enough to kill, but with the Leer, it should. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Soften you up a little bit. Other smog. A crit, seriously. I mean, at least you're not. At least you can't do anything to me. It's freaking smog and tackle. That's nothing. There we go. Beat you! 308 for winning, okay. Sure, I'll take that. Oh my god, Nidoran Nail's evolving! Whoa, are you serious? That is crazy. Alright, so this will at least make um, my Nidoran a little bit better. Now you're a Nidorino, which does improve your stats all a little bit. It's still not crazy good stats, it's not until Nidoking, so... But whatever, I need a Moonstone, that's the thing, I do need a Moonstone. All right. <laughs> wow. All right, well, he's gone. Oh my god, there's a Charmander guy over there. Am I gonna get a Charmander? Really? I'm not good at raising Pokemon. I feel sorry for my Charmander because it's not getting stronger. Sure. I've caught 50 Pokemon. You should catch more than that. What the shit? Oh, okay, so I have to catch 50, or 51, to get this Charmander. How can I see how many I've caught? 20? I've obtained 20. What the hell? Oh my god. There's a trainer there. There's a Pidgey, there's an item, I'll take the item. Raspberry. Alright, let's fight you. I saw your feet from the grass. I remember this line. People thought that um, that uh, Nintendo actually misspelled the word feet in the Gen 1 games. No, actually. One of the rare cases where they didn't make a mistake because there's so much fuck-ups about Gen 1, of course. But no. The feet is actually a word. It's like a streak, you know? So he's saying that he saw my streak of the Nugget Bridge from the grass when he was there in the grass. People thought he was saying, like, feet, like, you know, like, literally your body part at the bottom of your feet. Nope. Alright, horn attack. There we go. Simple one there. Look at this Nidorino being a little tougher now, a little bit buffed up. Hell yeah. I got two great balls from that. Okay. What was that? It's a Psyduck. Let me fight the Psyduck. Alright, Psyduck. Here we go. There we go. Look at that. Small circle. Excellent is what I got. Okay, I'm gonna end the video here. What the hell am I doing? Seriously. Alright, so before I end the video, I would like to encourage you to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and turn on notifications if you enjoyed the video. I post multiple gaming videos on a daily basis. So hopefully, you enjoy my channel. Oh god, bite? Oh yeah, you learned that bite. Uh, you're gonna get rid of Tail Whip. You have a huge variety of moves now, I guess. There we go. Spiro 13. Nidoran Female 15. Seriously? No. Shut up. Alright, that's it. <laughs> Just trying to finish this up, oh my god. Please. Alright. There. Finally. Alright. Bye-bye, everyone.